Good morning, everyone. Um, my name is Pas Tomasello. I'd like to welcome uh, the attendees on this morning's thematic webinar on an introduction to Autostore. By way of introduction, as I said, I'm Pas Tomasello and I'm the Senior Director of the Integrated Systems Group um, for ANZ for Domatic. Joining me today, all the way from Norway, is Magna Hatteland. Uh, he's the Media Director for Autostore and uh, he's actually going to be presenting the bulk of this morning's content. So welcome, Magna. This morning, we're going to be talking about um, Autostore, a piece pick solution powered by Domatic uh, in partnership with uh, our partner Autostore. So we'll talk about what is Autostore, how it works, what are the benefits of using Autostore, the flexibility that Autostore brings to the design and how it addresses a range of business sizes and industries. And Magna is going to provide some real world examples. We encourage you to enter questions into the chat box. We won't be answering the questions during the session, um, but we'll endeavour to get back to you within the next few days with answers to your questions. So again, we do encourage you to ask any questions that may pop up during the presentation. So at this stage, I'd like to hand over control to Magna, um, who will uh, take the bulk of this presentation this morning. Thank you again for your attendance. Thank you, Pass. I will just then uh, take over the screen, I guess. Yep, now you can see me. We have stored things in shelves forever. It's natural to us. We want things to be within an arm's reach. Robots, on the other hand, shouldn't have to. They shouldn't need rows of shelves or long walkways. So why waste time on shelf-based solutions when Auto Store is here? AutoStore is a cube-based system, making use of all space for proper warehousing. Turn that wasteful air into storage and double, triple, or even quadruple the inventory capacity without moving to a new building. Bins are stacked right next to each other, on top of each other. Radio-controlled robots drive on tracks above the cube, lifts down to grab bins and deliver them to workstations for order fulfillment or replenishment. All operations get done efficiently and accurately in high-speed workstations. To get to a lower bin in the cube, the robot digs out the bin systematically. Every bin delivered to the workstations will be placed back on the top, making slow-running products to sink to the bottom and high runners to stay on top. With this natural slotting, digging becomes a minimum, resulting in high-speed operations. Your building can be of any shape. All we need is a flat floor. The cube can be constructed around columns and oddly shaped rooms get properly utilized. If higher performance is needed, you can add more robots. If more storage is needed, we can expand your system without stopping current operations. Easy grid construction makes expansion fast and affordable. Build for today, expand tomorrow. Auto Store will never have a sick day. Even if a robot gets ill, the system will continue to deliver. It is a modular system, a flexible system you can trust. 10 robots use the same energy as one vacuum cleaner. Flick off lights and save that electric bill. Auto Store is being used all over the world in a great variety of industries. We have standard modules, but no standard system designs. Every system is thoroughly designed and simulated for performance and capacity before installation. AutoStore can connect to all warehouse management systems and will interact with other warehouse modules. Any robot can get any bin. Any bin can be delivered to any workstation. Your goods are still within an arm's reach. All of it.
Thank you for joining this AutoStore introduction webinar. My name is Magna Hatlan. I'm the marketing director for AutoStore, and I hope you're excited to see more of our unique system. I will not have time to get very technical, but we will run through the main components, a few basic principles, and look at some of the benefits AutoStore will give you. I hope you have seen the system before and uh, that you are somewhat familiar with it. AutoStore was created out of necessity. We used to do distribution of electronic components in the 70s, 80s, and 90s. And in the 90s, the business was booming. We built a big new warehouse and uh, we put all of our products inside and it was full within months. We figured we can't just continue building new warehouses when uh, we need more space. And our uh, technical director, Ingvar Hognaland, he looked over the warehouse and he had an idea. We are doing things wrong, he said. What is the most of in any warehouse? And that's air. Why are we storing things like dominoes if we could compress everything and put it together in a cube, like a Rubik's cube? It would be much more efficient and we would use the space much, much better. At the same time, warehousing should be much easier. And uh, the whole idea of getting the goods to you instead of going to the goods, that was the main principle of AutoStore. We quickly found out that this was not only our problem, but a problem that was the same all around the world. So we figured that we should become a robotics company. And um, seven years later, with long time of development, uh, we had a good product that we introduced to the Norwegian market, where we're from. And that is almost uh, 18 years ago now. Today, we have around 300 systems installed in 28 countries, with millions of bins operated by thousands of robots for some of the world's largest brands to tiny production offices. And we keep on growing. AutoStore is the world's fastest growing material handling system. This animation shows the essence of AutoStore. Here you have normal shelves, shelving racks that you can see in most warehouses today. We take away the racks, the shelves, we take all the goods, put them in a cube, we put them inside boxes, inside of an AutoStore grid. And as you can see, we have now only used one fourth of the same space. We could quadruple the space or the inventory capacity in that area with AutoStore. And not only that, but you will get a much, much, much higher performance with AutoStore robots. AutoStore is a 100% modular system. It is standardized and uh, you could use it as building blocks. Not two systems are the same, but all of the systems have these five components. First off, we have the bin. It comes in two sizes. They are 60 centimeters times 40 centimeters, and you can get them in 20 centimeters height or in 30 centimeters height. That's the inside dimension. The bins are self-supported. It's a very strong structure that can hold the weight of all the bins on top of it. And they are specialized, made to be handled with uh, care by auto store robots. The bins are made of plastic and they are 100% renewable. We also deliver them in ESD plastic. The grid is the skeleton of an auto store system. It is holding in place all the bins, but it is also the rails for the robots. It is only 16 parts, so it's very easy to put together, and that makes it very fast to construct. All we need is a flat floor. The workstations is where the goods goes in and out to auto store bins. We have uh, different designs of workstations. We call them ports and uh, they have different functions and depending on the handling time of the operator. Then we have the robot. The robot is the main running part of an auto store system. It used to be a very complicated construction and it had all kinds of sensors and very advanced technology. Now we have dumbed it down to a minimum of moving parts and it's a very very steady construction. It doesn't do a lot of thinking. All the thinking is done by the controller which is the mastermind of the whole auto store operation. It will opportunity charge whenever it needs. And it is digging bins with its gripper plate that I will show you in a few slides. As I mentioned, the controller is the mastermind of an auto store system. It has been developed over 25 years and it has just been strengthened and strengthened with new algorithms. And it is just a very, very sophisticated traffic controller. All of these five components are in any auto store system. Some have 250,000 bins, um, others have 1,000. Some have 200 robots, others have five. It depends on what speed you need, what performance throughput you need, 
And um, that is something that we would design and simulate so you would easily know what you would get before you buy an AutoStore system. There is a couple of principles I always want to explain right away with AutoStore. First off, let's talk about digging. This is what the robots are made for, to dig and drive. They will take out one in one bin to the top until they reach the bin that is requested. Then another robot will come and clean up and put the bins back in the exact same order. Well, I have to remind you that AutoStore or any ASR system is not used like a vending machine. You don't go up to a system and request one item. Normally orders are lined up in a wave, typically 30 minutes before. In an auto store workstation, you would not notice if the bin is from the top or from the bottom of the cube. But let's say you want a rush order from the lowest bin immediately. It would only take the digging operations 3 minutes and 36 seconds to get to the lowest bin. But the likelihood of that being the case is very small. Let's move over to one of the things that fascinates me most about AutoStore. Some of the best warehouses in the world are using AutoStore and they are taking advantage of a few mathematical phenomenons. Every time a bin moves in and out of a workstation, the bin is placed back on the top of the grid. By using this basic logic only, we end up with a perfect natural slotting. A cross section of an AutoStore system is always showing high runners at the top and low runners at the bottom. Combine that with the always occurring Pareto principle in retail where 20% of the inventory is 80% of the turnover and you have a perfect match. Those 20% would be lying on the top levels and digging is normally a minimum. Also perfect for seasonal changes. There's a lot of cool features with AutoStore and especially in the traffic and error handling systems. It is all very systematical and mathematical, but we will not get too deep into that now. Let's move over to some of the key benefits that AutoStore will give you. AutoStore is the market leader in storage density. Normally we can see an increase of uh, four times the storage capacity going from manual operation to installing an AutoStore. Sometimes it's more. And compared to other material handling systems, AutoStore is normally twice as space efficient. Instead of making a new warehouse to expand your operations, you could make room in your own warehouse to expand your operations. And we could make AutoStore warehouses in any shape. We even have a warehouse that is round. Your warehouse is a specialized room made to hold inventory. We like to say stop air housing, start warehousing. Air is expensive to heat, to clean, to cool, but most of all, it's expensive to pay rent on storing air. So stop air housing, start warehousing. We are very proud of the reliability of the system. It is a system you can trust. We have no single point of failure. So even if a robot has an issue, you can take it off without stopping operations. And actually from all of our systems worldwide, the average uptime is 99.6%. The same time you get an access to all of your inventory. Doesn't matter where you are standing, what workstation you are in, you would always get an access to 100% of your inventory. If you compare this to say a normal mini load system where you would have uh, say five lanes, if one of these lanes breaks down, 20% of your inventory is gone until it's fixed. This would not happen with an auto source system. Sure, a robot could have an issue breakdown or a work workstation could break down, but you always have access to 100% of your inventory. I think one of the most important things when buying a material handling system is that it, it is future-proof. You have to have a system you can grow with, a system you can expand, and a system that would change with the way business are going. And AutoStore is just that kind of system. You're not buying a box of constraints. You're buying for whatever you need today. And uh, whenever you need to expand, you can expand the storage capacity by adding more bins. Um, you can expand more robots if you want to have higher performance. And you can do all of this without stopping ongoing operations. It is also a green system. We often see that warehouse lighting uses more power than AutoStore. So you would actually save power by installing uh, AutoStore because you can flick off the lights. And of course, you use less space. There are many value adding factors to AutoStore and you would definitely get better use of manpower. You also get a total inventory control and uh, close to 100% accuracy. This is getting more and more important as customer satisfactory is very, very important. And uh, some of our installations, they value the fact that AutoStore is very easy to secure. We have, uh, for instance, at Gucci in Italy, they put AutoStore in uh, 
side of their factory. So they store all of their um, gold, platinum, silver, and um, those things for their bags inside of AutoStore. And they can have it very protected with uh, walls around it. And we even have the Central Bank of Russia storing money inside of AutoStore. It is customized. It is made for you. And uh, we build it to requirements without surprises. Nobody likes surprises in our industry. And you would get exactly what we have simulated and designed so you would know exactly how it would run. We do all this by looking at your exact logistical data and we look at the peaks and we figure out what you need today, what you would need maybe tomorrow. And then we could also see what, what you would need in five years. AutoStore is a black box system, meaning that we know exactly where all the bins are at all time, but we don't know what's inside of the bins. That's where we connect the WMS system. AutoStore can be the main part of a warehouse or it can be a part of it. It's made to communicate with other systems. There are four big trends that are defining our industry and AutoStore is a great fit with the coming trends. First off, we have had a huge growth in e-commerce all around the world and it keep on growing. Customers expect uh, fast delivery and um, three out of four people will own a mobile phone connected by 2030. The fourth industrial revolution has been here for a while and if you're not thinking about automating, you are probably already behind. People are moving closer and closer to the urban centers and uh, urbanization is uh, everywhere around the world and it's more and more important to be close to the city core and uh, using the space properly. Also omnichannel is on the rise with the high demand for fast delivery, speed and accuracy. AutoStore fits all of these trends very well and uh, we are ready for the future. I hope this uh, was interesting and uh, that you've learned more about AutoStore. Uh, to learn even more, go to autostoresystem.com or get in touch with us. Thank you for listening and uh, joining in. Have a good day. Bye. Thank you.